Milroux will serve as our inspiration. He was an abstract artist, and his unconventional painting is free form, an assemblage technique, that is his fitting together of his shapes, had a profound influence on graphic artists. He used his imagination and he used the canvas in a creative way. We will use his uver, his body of work, as a departure for your creative design assignment. We're gonna st we'll start by opening Illustrator and naming our type, portrait, and your name, and hitting OK, making sure that your size is letter. Now, Miro is our inspiration. Your homework is your guide. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be using the spray to do a composition using two typefaces. What I'll need to do is come over and type a letter. Next, you need to explore the typefaces on your computer. You may want to combine two typefaces of different family types, or you may want to combine one typeface of different families. I'll show you what I mean. So I could go with a gill sand. Next I need to go to my symbols and drag my B into my symbols. And this will be a graphics. Next I'm going to come over, next I'll come over to my spray symbol. I'll delete everything. Now I will start to draw my B. That's the beginning of it. Then I'm going to explore my symbols by doing my size. And I can come in, increase a few. I can hold down my Alt key to make my letters smaller. Come up with another text. And here I'm going to go G. I'm going to vary it lowercase. To give it a different color by going to my color palette. Now I'll take my gill sand and once again drag it into my symbols. Hit OK. I'm going to delete it from my page. Go back to my spray symbol. time I'm going to do the scruncher for it. And I'll practice again my size, holding down my alt to make them smaller. It is a whole group. And there I have a typographical design swooping down with my letters that I have just created. 